Welcome back to The Couch with Mtwagazi. Earlier on in the show, we sat down with them, lead singer of the African fusion band with the same name. She joins us again with fellow bandmate, Luyolo Lenga, who also happens to be her partner. Welcome, Luyolo. Lovely to uh, have you with you us. Thank you very much. Yes. It's good to be here. Yeah. What does yeah. Mtwagazi mean, actually? Well, um, Mtwa um, is a word that we use, actually, to define um, a, a son person, actually. And um, Mtwagazi, then, becomes a female um, counterpart uh, to umtwa, which is a male um, um, uh, person. Oh. And so, yes, umtwa kazi means like koisan woman. Oh, that's incredible. Yes. And yeah. you guys are partners, so that's quite appropriate. Did you meet before the music or after the music? Mm. Well... <laughs> During the music. <laughs> During the music. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we met at uh, Forte school. University yeah. Music School, you know, and uh, I find that perhaps this bow music has, um, 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 we gravitated towards finding these instruments and so we found each other at the same time. That's you so know. How romantic. <laughs> we love a good love well, story. Well then can you teach me to play some bow music so that of Cupid's course. bow can find my bow? <laughs> so this one is called Oadi. So you basically uh -huh. um, have your three fingers, like one, two, three, down the stick. Yeah. And then these two that will hold the string. Sure. And then you put your stick in between these fingers. Yeah. And then your wrist would be then loose. Then you start packing. Oh, open, close, open, close, open, close. I trust wow. you will do well. You trust Ooh, actually, well. actually, it looks nice in on Gini, you. In Genie, we oh. trust. It looks nice on oh. me. Yeah. So okay, so three you. fingers. And it kind of goes with your shoes. Yes, don't pull it. Just put the, the thumb forward. Yeah. Can. Yeah, try to play open, close, open, close. Relax. <laughs> there you go. Can I hold it like that? Maybe no. for now. Just open your finger. Yeah. No, I've got no coordination. Okay, when do I? Just relax your wrist. Okay, yeah. Yeah, and then play. Like your wrist so like she this. just keeps tapping, but yeah. she opens and yeah. closes her finger. Yeah. <laughs> Is it almost like doing it's this? It's not bad. <laughs> <laughs> She's already moving. She's already performing, eh? I can jam, man. Yeah. Look at you, babe. <laughs> well, this one I've is totally crazy. lost my to technique. To, to play? Bottom yeah, top. I think this one. Bottom and top. And then you just keep flicking it with your other finger. Yes. Yeah. This is, and this one is called Dumakoyana, which comes from the Zulu people. That one is a Kosa one. Wow. Okay, wow. Amazing. So are you guys making these instruments yourself? Yes. Yes. Um, I've got a skill. Actually, I believe it comes from our ancestors, you know. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, we produce these instruments and we go around uh, teaching schools and teachers, you amazing. know, how to make the instruments and um, to, own them. to use them and stuff. And we're trying to produce as much as possible that we can supply the schools that have a um, music subject, actually. Um, because at some point, we met with a teacher who was saying, I'm busy teaching children about bow instruments, but the only reference we have is only a picture in a book. Oh. So guys, you need to actually make these instruments yeah. so that we have them for school. So yeah. that is one other project that we're busy working on now. Yeah, it's preserving well, such I'll a beautiful I'll definitely send my sons to you. So <laughs> yes. Yeah. Now, I'm not They'll convinced on my, my game here, my bow game. <laughs> so we're going to listen to you guys perform in a little okay. while. Yes. <laughs> no problem. We'll be right back after this. <laughs>